Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we are back in Overlook Bay, and today we are here with our fellow Marshmallow. We love her so much. Isn't she so cute just like sitting on the sofa like that? <laughs> she is so adorable. I love it. So in today's video, we are going to be talking about what we think is going to be the next mythic pet. And if you guys didn't know, or if you're new to playing Overlook Bay, this is um, Overlook Bay's first mythic pet. Um, this is a rainbow shiny celebration dragon. So this pet was actually available in the game during New Year's for about a week. So this pet is really hard to find, especially in the rainbow shiny version of it. Look at her, she's so cute. So in today's video, we're gonna be talking about what we think may be the next mythic pet. And Wonderworks Studios just announced that the next mythic pet is actually going to be coming in the Valentine's Day update. So I'm going to read this tweet right here. Valentine's Festival Tea. Overlook Bay's Valentine's Festival will bring so many awesome things to the game. Here's a list of a few. So as we can see on the top of the list, one new mythic pet. Oh my gosh, guys, I am so excited to find out what this new mythic pet is going to be. We also have five new pets for gems, so it is confirmed that there is going to be pets that are gems rather than Robux, which I'm so excited for. Um, I was really looking for the V to be like a gems pet, but unfortunately it wasn't, but that's totally fine. We still have a bunch of bees and stuff, but I really like being able to um, buy pets with gems instead of using Robux. Um, there will also be two new vehicles, five new personal vehicles, three collectibles, one new house, and 25 new furniture. So we're going to be able to decorate. Um, also, there's going to be another house. So I guess I'm going to be decorating another Valentine's Day theme house. So stay tuned for that. I did a live stream this week where I decorated like a Valentine's Day tiny house. So I will link that in the corner in the eye. All right. So we're going to the pet shop because the pet shop just got remodeled. And I really liked to um, film videos in here. I'm going to put marshmallow. Oh. Oh, she was facing the light. Okay, I'm gonna sit right here. Uh, we're just going to chill and chat and stuff. Um, but anyways, guys, um, I'm going to share some photos on the screen. Okay, so the first photo that I'm going to show you guys is actually Cuppy 97's inspiration for the Cupid's Teddy. Here's the original concept art that everyone has been inspired by. I'm genuinely so thankful. So many people love this design and so many people have made drawings inspired by one of my designs. So this is the first pet that could possibly be the next mythic pet and the reason why I'm sharing this pet first is because not only is Cuppy97 my YouTube best friend but also because I'd love to see this pet in the game as we can see um, the Cupid's Teddy has like a little halo he also has a little um, arrow holder I'm not sure the exact name of what that is, but as we can see, this teddy bear represents Cupid and Cupid is like a little love angel. Um, he's so cute. He also has like a little heart on his chest where his actual heart is, guys, and your heart is actually located on your left side. Your left side, but basically in the photo, our right side. And he also has like wings and stuff. Look at that. Okay, so as we can see, um, the wings in the picture look like they're actually detached from the body, but I think that's actually a really cool concept to add. Um, for example, Adopt Me Pets, they have feet, right? But their feet isn't really attached to their body. It's kind of just like little um, shapes that are like floating underneath their bodies, if that makes sense. So I really like to be able to see like floating wings and stuff like that, like detached from their body. I think that kind of just looks really cool and mythical. And I can definitely see this pet as a mythical pet. So the next um, photo I'm going to share on the screen is um, someone actually took the um, regular Teddy from the Christmas update and kind of just put Cuppy's work into like play. So for example, this one is from B-L-X-S-T-N. Um, I'm not sure how you say his name. Is it Blackston or Blexton? Uh, <laughs> usually sometimes X's represent A's for like aesthetic usernames. So that's why I say it as Blackston. But Cupid Teddy, heavily inspired by Cuppy97's amazing drawing. 
Hope you like it. And this is basically what the pet would look like in Overlook Bay. So we have the pink ears, the pink nose, um, just like a bunch of like the pink detailing like on its little paws and its little belly and stuff. So basically that's what it would look like. We also have like the angel wings in the back as we can see. I honestly really want this pet to be in the game. I would love to see this as a new mythic pet, guys. What do you think is going to be the new mythic pet? Okay, so the next pets that I'm going to show you guys is actually concept art from Moon Dust Bree. Um, Wonderworks Studios actually tweeted this on their Twitter asking if they would like to see, asking us if we would like to see these pets in the game. So the first picture I have right here is um, some Valentine's Day inspired unicorns. Of course in this game we have like a lot of unicorns. For example, we have the Rainbow Rider, we have the Alicorn, we have the regular unicorn. Um, we also have like the shadow corns as well, which I love, but I really love seeing reskins of unicorns. I think that they're just so magical and cool. So basically, as you can see on the screen, we have a pink unicorn, we have a white unicorn and a red unicorn, and they're all so cute. I love how the white one has wings to it, so it's kind of like a pegasus in a way, I guess. It's like a pegasus, like a unicorn with wings or something, or maybe that's an alicorn actually. I don't know, all these mythical creatures. <laughs> if I had to choose one of those unicorns, I would probably pick either the white one or the red one. I think the red one is really unique because I feel like not a lot of people like the color red and I think it'd be really cool to see that, especially like look at the hair detailing on the red unicorn, like there's hearts and stuff on it. So this is pretty much it for the first um, pet concept. So the next pet concept is the ladybug guys. And I have a strong feeling that this could actually be the next mythical pet too as well. Um, I don't know if you would call Ladybug a mythical pet because it is pretty much an insect or a bug. Um, as you guys know, in this game, we have like three bug pets. I could be wrong, but we have the Bumblebee, the Firefly, and the Spider. So two of those pets came from the Halloween update. And then as we can see right here, the Bumblebee just came to the new pet shop remodel. In the picture that you guys see right here, so if you guys didn't know, mythical pets evolve every single time you make it into like a shiny or rainbow shiny. So as we can see in the photo, um, there is three different colored ladybugs. The first one is just brown and red. So basically that might actually be the default version of like the mythical pet that you can buy. If you turn the ladybug into just a a shiny pet then the wings can be pink like that but if you make a rainbow shiny guys you can get like a purpley blue kind of um ladybug as you can see as the bottom one so that one actually kind of reminds me of like the colors of the narwhal a lot of people love the colors of the narwhal so this is probably another example of what could be like a mythical pet the same can go for like the unicorns as well so maybe like um as you age them up and make them a shiny or rainbow shiny they change colors and that's what i really love about the mythical pet concept in overlook bay so this is the ladybug pet and i'd really love to see this in the game i have never seen um a ladybug pet any of like these adopting pet games so that's pretty cool and then the next um the last picture i'm actually going to show you guys in this video today is candy pets so i feel like candy is really big on valentine's day especially chocolate and as we can see from the top, we have three lollipop pets. So one is just red. The next one is like a gradient of purple and pink. And then the last one is a rainbow version. So we could possibly be seeing like these as pets as well as the new mythic pet because as you can see, they have like three transformations and stuff. I think that is what Brie was thinking about when she came up with these concepts is like, what can the this specific pet like evolve into every time you make it a shiny or rainbow shiny oh my gosh guys let me know what you think about having a lollipop pet like how crazy is that like we're we're going from actual like animals to actual like items being pets and that's kind of weird right but that's also pretty cool and stuff um, it definitely adds a lot more creativity to this game. So the next pet, as we can see on the bottom, is like chocolate pet. So the first one is like uh, probably like milk chocolate, dark chocolate. Um, and then the next one is like white chocolate. And then we also have a strawberry candy bar. 
Oh my gosh, it looks so cute. Honestly, guys, if you look closely at it, the chocolate part kind of looks like their brains or something because their eyeballs are like all the way to the bottom. <laughs> I don't know. I think these are so cute as well. Um, I honestly don't know, okay? They're adding one mythical pet and five gem pets. So that means there's going to be six pets total within the game, guys. Six new pets. We're getting six new pets. I don't really know. Like so far in all the pets that I've shown you, we have one uh two three four five we have five pets like pet concepts that we can probably pull from this of course once the festival releases in that update i'm going to be doing a live stream um you guys really love it when i do live streams for updates or i do like building live streams and stuff so let me know in the comments down below if you would like me to do a live stream oh my gosh okay so down to my final thoughts of what i think is going to be the mythical pet the next mythical pet um, I can definitely see the Cupid's Teddy um, being a mythical pet, so maybe they might do like a color um, reskin, like having a red teddy bear or like a pink teddy bear. And then once we make it to like a rainbow shiny, it ends up being the white teddy bear with like the pink detailing and stuff. So I can definitely see that into like a concept. And the last pet I see being a potential second mythical pet or mythic pet in this game is definitely the ladybug like i have never seen anything like that before that is going to be the end of this video i really hope that you guys enjoyed all credits go to the artists cuppy 97 and moon dust brie um, i really love their pet concepts i would really love to see all the pets mentioned in this video being in the valentine's day update because they're all super amazing and i honestly i'm just so excited to see what's going to be the new mythical pet it took me two weeks to um level up marshmallow into rainbow shiny and it's probably going to take me two weeks again to level up the next mythical pet into a rainbow shiny make sure to hit that subscribe button so that you can become part of the donut squad we are growing so fast and I absolutely love every single one of you guys. And thank you so much for showing your endless support for the channel, guys. Thank you so much. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I will see you next time. Bye.